for me, um, when I went through this journey of wanting to, to do and serve humanity, it really started when I watched the movie Gandhi. And that movie, I was very young when Richard Attenborough's movie came out. And I really was so in, inspired by how one small man could shift an entire you know, British Empire down to their knees, right? Because of that inspiration of the collective nature of everybody coming together. So I, but I've always used to think like, if you solve environmental problem or you solve hunger or you solve education or you solve something, then there will be peace in this world. And in my later years, I came across the Baha'i faith, which I then embraced as part of my own faith. And one of the reasons I take, I embraced the Baha'i faith is because it made a lot of sense to me. And one of the things the Baha'i Faith says is that unity has to come first. Then the other problems will be solved. And we tend to get it the other way around. We think when we solve it, we will have unity. It says you work on unity, we will solve hunger, we will solve the climate problem. Because we are united as consciousness and we are also united with nature. If we are united with nature and with oneness, we will not defile nature. If we are united as people, I will not let you starve because you're united with me. And that made a lot of sense to me. And this is something I actually also expressed in the program, in the Edmund Hillary program, that I feel that the program, besides having that, that Maori thing in, in, as the core, that core can be used as in a way to create a new unity, a new sense of unity that most people don't have baggage about. So it gives them an opportunity to come together in spirit as one, because I feel that if we have that, then diversity can exist. Without the unity, diversity will not work. It has to be unity in diversity. It has to be unity, then solve the problems of the world in unity. So in Angels of Impact, for example, we say that our work is about eradicating poverty in unity with women, including women in the equation, not excluding them. So that's where I feel unity is core to everything. And I, and, I, and I wish and hope that people will see that because everyone's so busy out there solving the problems of the world when we should be busy about creating unity and then we can solve it together.